A and B alternately throw a pair of dice. A wins if it throws a sum of 5 before B throws a sum of 8. And B wins if it throws a sum of 8 before A throws sum of 5. So, when you throw a pair of dice, throw karte hai, so number of elements in sample space is 36. Now, what is probability of getting sum as 5? So, sum 5 ka a pair of dice mein, when your outcomes are 1, 4, 2, 3, 3, 2 and 4, 1. So, 4 favorable cases are there out of 36. So, sum as 5 is having probability 1 by 9. Now, what is probability of getting sum as 8? So, when we are looking for sum as 8, so how can we get sum as 8? We cannot have 1, 7. We will start from 2, 6, 3, 5, 4, 4, 5, 3, and 6, 2. These are the 5 possibilities out of total 36. So, probability of getting sum as 8 is 5 by 36. Now, who is starting this? E is starting. E is throwing first and we have to find the priority that A wins. So how it can be possible? First case is A is throwing and A wins. Second is A is not winning but he is starting with. Then B is also not winning because we we are looking for the priority of A to win. So at the end we will make A win. So th this is the second case. Or first A will lose, then B will lose, then again A will lose, then B will lose and finally A will win. So this will form an infinite GP. Such type of questions can be done using infinite GP probability concept. Now, A will win when he gets sum as 5. And getting priority is 9 for sum as 5. So 1 by 9 plus, now A is not winning. So winning is 1 by 9. So not winning is 8 by 9 in a single thrown of pair of dice. B dash. B will win when he gets sum as 8. But that is not happening. So 1 minus 5 by 36, which is 31 by 36. But at the end, A wins. So it is having priority 1 by 9. Now this A dash, B dash is repeated twice. So it will be 8 by 9 and 31 by 36 two times. And similarly, it will be three times so on. So it is following a GP where first term is 1 by 9. And common ratio is 8 by 9 into 31 by 36. What is sum of infinite terms of GP formula? That is first term by 1 minus common ratio. So it will be 1 by 9 whole divided by 1 minus 8 by 9 into 31 by 36. Let's simplify this. We can cancel 4 from here and here and we'll get it as 1 by 9 divided by 1 minus 62 by 81. So it will be 9 by 81 minus 62, which will turn out to be 9 by 19. 9 by 19 is there in the second option. And yes, that is the answer given to us.